Happy Mother's Day. Hopefully I have this uploaded on Sunday. I hope you guys have a wonderful uh, and glorious day uh, per usual. I did take the time to enjoy my weekend. I did my own nails and my foot at home. I did a little spa thing on Friday and Saturday, just relaxed. And Sunday we went out, had a baby dedication and um, had a really pleasant Sunday, you guys. So I'm using this brand new uh, Translucent from LA and I don't like it at all. So it really created such a dry patch. It, it, I mean, it's drying up right as we speak, but I'll find a way to work with it. Um, I've put on the Urban Decay Potion Prime and also the Electric Palette by them, which I adore this palette so much. It has, an ama it has amazing pigments. Um, and now I'm just working it in with one of my brushes that I got from, where did I get these brushes from? Oh, Wish. They're nice and soft, so they don't don't bother the lids at all with applying it. And I use this beautiful blue color. And now I'm gonna just use the other blue that's on top to, to put in the center area, just to give it a dramatic look. This would be my Mother's Day look that I obviously did not wear for Mother's Day. If you do follow me on Instagram, I normally change it up just a tad bit. A lot of people don't like it to be too dark. I mean, real life people at Know, that I have to face <laughs> um, so I did brighten it up from Mother's Day when we did go out uh, for brunch um, also just blended it with the terracotta from LA uh, the single eyeshadow that I love so much and now I will be look how you know you see I'm not gonna be able to work that translucent powder in properly but it, you could just see how drying it looks so I'm gonna be using the Tarte palette to contour and just blend that in and cheeks just apply it in and now uh, within that same palette, it has a highlight. I decided to use that um, for the uh, brow area. And now I'm using Essie as a, to line my, um, as an eyeliner. That would be from my Ulta haul. So I'll just sit there and try to create One day I'm gonna do an eyeliner, uh, a wing, eventually. It's gonna be one of my other goals. Here are one of the lashes, one of my favorite every day. Not too heavy, not too extreme. That will apply. And um, just gonna clean up using one of the wipes that I got from Dollar Tree. Um, but definitely. Not too big of a fan of the LA translucent powder. So here I am putting Cover Girls uh, powder, press powder, to set my face. And the mascara from Maybelline to do my bottom lashes. Really love that pop of blue. And this is an, I, uh, an highlighter that I got from Shop, Me, Shop Miss A years ago that I still love. About two years ago that I found. I was happy to find that. And I'm using the Fix Plus. And I normally don't use it to set my face, but because of how drying uh, the translucent created uh, such a patchy look. I normally don't use it for setting my face. I normally just use it to help with pigments, but with uh, the Urban Decay Electric Palette, there's no need to to apply it to the, to the lids. But 
the, the lip color is from um, Shop Miss A. It's this pink color that I hauled recently. And the liner is also from, nope, it's from Wish as well. It's a purple color. So I just used it to create an ombre look. And that lash is about to fall off. So I just need to press it down some more. And I will fix that later. You guys have a blessed one. Thank you. Bye.